Someone asked me what I think the red flags are when dating a man to know whether or not he's going to be a good husband and a good father. And here's the thing, everybody's definition of good is different, but I also don't always think there's a red flag, unfortunately, because society teaches us who to be as men and women. And oftentimes men are great partners until kids come along. And so here's the thing, if it were up to me and I was going on a first date again, this is the question I would ask. I would ask him to tell me about his childhood, to tell me about his parents in a way like surface level, like, oh, did they work? Did they stay at home? Did you like that? What they say will reveal a lot about what they expect from their future partner and that person as a parent, right? If they say my mom was a stay at home mom and I absolutely loved having her there and she really did everything. She cooked, she cleaned, she took care of us. She really did it all. And I want that for my kids. Well, that's going to tell you what he expects of a future partner. And you can say, hey, interesting. So if you have a stay-at-home mom, you know, did, was she compensated in some sort of way? Did she have a retirement account? Like, what did that look like? Or some men will say things like, I love an ambitious woman. I want like a woman who goes after what she wants. Cool. But if she's doing that, will you also step up at home? Will you support her at home and with children? Because that will also tell you a lot. So there's not always red flags immediately and they're just behaviors, but the answers to those questions will tell you a lot. So have the hard conversations often and early. It reveals so much about a person and will just inform you on your decision-making before you have kids with somebody, which